I was born in Shreveport, Louisiana, and probably what they call it as the worst neighborhood in Shreveport, Louisiana. They call it the bottoms. I think that from the outset, I was numbered as statistic that I wouldn't make it. Six of us graduated from high school. Three of us made it to college. Only two of us graduated from college. Several are in jail. Uh, two were murdered. So from joining gangs, selling drugs, uh, just walking down the street, you, you could die. Just because you're in the wrong neighborhood or someone from another neighborhood comes through, just take your life. So it's tough. It's really tough out there for all kids. So I know what they're going through. The children that we serve face more in a morning getting ready for school than most of us face in a lifetime. They live in abject poverty, come from some of the worst neighborhoods, and are really incredible kids. The good news about children that come to the Lighthouse is that they're at a huge advantage over children that don't participate in an after-school program. We have over 400 children that we serve every afternoon in our Lighthouse program. And they not only get to come in and have, um, have a snack or a meal that can kind of bolster them, they also have mentors and tutors. They're much more likely to pass their um, standardized tests in any of their schools. And our motto is once a lighthouse kid, always a lighthouse kid. We're going to follow them from the time that they enter our program until they're in college and beyond that. I started coming to Volunteers of America at age 12. Uh, in some after school programs and it's just the positivity that kept me here and kept me in school and just kept me on the right track. Michael is absolutely an inspiration to every child that we serve and it's wonderful for him to come back here and see the kids because they know I can go to college I can even get an advanced degree I mean you know this guy's gonna be an attorney which is really exciting Sometimes the kids just need somebody to listen to them. So just have to be there for them. The kids really need to see more people in a positive light. You know, they, they need to see more people come here and volunteer and share their time. Because it's something when you just got off work and you come down here to Volunteers America and spend time with these kids for a couple hours a day, that's saying something to those kids. It's saying that you, you really want to see them accomplish something.